What's up everybody, it's your boy Reddings Black and I'm back with another video. So, I got five tips today. Five tips for a better morning routine. Number one, don't check your phone. Now, I understand if you have business, if you got work, anything like that, you have to, you gotta check the emails, you gotta text somebody back, maybe somebody's called you, need you, whatever. That's fine, I understand. Go do your business, do what you gotta do. But other than that, checking your phone and blasting yourself with chaotic information, all this just notifications, news, uh, social media, all that stuff, the first thing you see when you wake up in the morning, it's not very healthy. Um, I know for me personally, I developed an anxiety about waking up and checking my phone. I didn't even want to hear my phone vibrate. I would be nervous when people call me. I still, sometimes still, my heart will flutter sometimes when people call me. That's how bad it got. Just from that opening of um, the uh, the opening of my day, the first thing I do when I wake up is look at all that stuff on my phone, and you know sometimes stuff has happened, and then you develop that that fear of something always happening, and so that anxiety would carry throughout the day, just from how I started the day with all that chaos on my phone. So. You know, some people have no notifications. <laughs> Power to you if you got no notifications. But, um, yeah, having all that stuff on your mind when your mind is at its freshest is not good. It can be very detrimental to you and your day and your mind. So, that's why I say don't check your phone. Still haven't checked my phone yet. So, number two, get out of bed and stretch. Now, in this moment... You can you stretch, you know, look around, pray. You know, if you if you are religious, if you pray, pray, um, be grateful. Look out the window, look at the the sunlight in the morning time. Beautiful morning, awesome. Do that when you first get out of bed. But you got to make yourself get up and get out of bed. Now, that's been, always been a struggle for me is getting up and getting out of bed. I roll out of bed sometimes, and I'm off balance when I stand up. So, but anyway, I get out of bed and I'm able to stretch and, you know, pop my back, pop my neck, all that stuff. And number three, go to the bathroom. That should be, that's self-explanatory. This is like, these are just basic tips. Self-explanatory, go to the bathroom, do your business. Um, you know, all that stuff, brush your teeth, everything, do that. And maybe you take a shower, all that stuff, do that. And then... Come back to your room, come back to the, go to the kitchen, wherever, and be present. Maybe walk around a bit. Uh, you can look out the window again, be present. Just let your mind sit for a second, be silent, and prepare yourself. Now, at this point, you can, after you do that, you can check your phone if you need to, if you want to. Just check your phone. Um, you can check your phone number three or four, okay? But I would advise doing it at number four. So, then after that, you go into number five, the last thing, and that's eat breakfast, do some light exercise, and get your day started. Now, I have a problem with eating breakfast. I'm going to have to go make myself eat breakfast right now because usually I skip breakfast most of the time, and I'll eat because by the time I really am ready to eat, it'll be like 11, 12, and that's lunchtime. So, um, go eat breakfast. Eat a, you know, it doesn't have to be a heavy breakfast. It could be a light one. And then go do light exercises. Now, some people get out and run. Some people go um, to the gym. Some people do all that stuff in the morning time. That's your routine for exercise. Do it. More power to you. I like that. Mine, I do 23, 23 or 24 push-ups. Um, like 40 sit-ups, crunches. And then I do about 14 ab rolls on the, on the little ab roll I have sitting over there. And that's my light exercise for the morning. Because some, especially if I don't go to the gym, I'll do that multiple times within the day. So just having that, you know, you don't have to go hard sometimes. You know, you just woke up, but that's why I say stretch. So you can stretch again, and um, then do your light exercise, and then get your day started. And that's a better, healthier way to have your brain, you know, starting to, you know, get the gears going. Got your arms, limbs loosened up. You know, you feel that exercise, your muscles, you know, you done did your push-ups, whatever. And you feel better about the day, going into the day, because you started it off more peacefully. It's all about starting, giving yourself more peace before you enter whatever else is going to happen during the day. And bringing yourself to that, 
balanced, peaceful place is important because always being chaotic, all that chaos constantly is not is not good. And it, it can be detrimental, like I said, it can be detrimental to your mental health. It can be detrimental to you. So I want to live a long time. I want to have a I want to have a good life. I want to have a peace of mind during my life. I want peace in my life. And I decided that and that's what I, I choose to do that. That's why I, I'm going to follow this every day. Now, sometimes I might not be able to hit all these every day because, you know, work, whatever else. And you might not be able to hit this every day because of whatever reason. But if you can hit at least three of them, at least four, maybe you don't get to the fifth. Maybe one is missing. But if you can at least hit three or four, that's a start. That's a good start. And number one is the most important, but that's a good start. So that's why I encourage everybody to try this morning routine, basic morning routine. Some people may disagree. Let me know. That's fine. If you disagree, if you have a different way, go ahead. Let me know. I'm cool with that. Um, but it's all about providing a better way forward for everybody, giving some peace, peace of mind to us all, because that's what we need at the end of the day. It helps everybody function better, having a better peace of mind. So, um, yeah, let me know what you guys think about it. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, like, comment, comment, subscribe, like, whatever you do, whatever you do, just do it. It's your boy Red X Black, and I'm out. Peace.